We're at Atlanga Historical Site, which is a mining place. So there's tons of mines out here, as you probably know. I really like my rocks. Gold mine. And uh, right here, we've got some battery stampers. Sometimes these are in the water, sometimes they're not there. It really just depends where they're mining. Sometimes they mine for gold in the water. But here. There's the gold rush in the red centre. This just crushes those rocks and gold turns to nuggets like that then at that point they can melt rings and what else i think when they crush it so then, then they put it through a certain through a special chemical and then it separates yeah, the gold yeah but they crush it i know this is a big belt that turns this wheel this wheel i imagine not sure what it is not snakes but this battery stand but these big posts one goes up while the other goes down the other goes up then you know, it goes like that. bang, 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 like big hammers. You're crushing it, crushing it. This is only a little one, they get much bigger. You can see how it works. Get the radar. This probably needs to be a steam engine because they've gone over there. Yeah, definitely. Kerosene and petrol engines. They drive this belt. Okay, so it drives these wheels. Yeah. Off these wheels you can run a couple of different machines. Okay, so you can so the oh, belt turn from this one. This one. Yeah, they still move. Still works. All this stuff still works. So they have the belt going from there usually up to there. And that spins those. And these things here they'll lift up your stampers. Drop them. And then here we have the hammers. Stampers are small, some are bigger. See, this is only a double. They're your big heavy hammers. Right there. So they'll shovel your rubble into here. It will be smaller. Yeah. It might come from the big one into the smaller one. Yeah, yeah. And these hammers have got these, these cans. Yeah. Okay, then pushes it, yeah. Alright, it'll go over and then it'll just drop. It'll fall Boom. off the edge and yeah. then just drop down and crush it and boof. And those hammers will just. And this is what they put in the stampers. Rocks like that. Where's the quartz? There could be gold. And then the gold sinks. Yeah. And then gold sinks and they get their little shovels and have a little dig in there. Yeah. Hello. Hello, kids. It's a frill neck, is it? Mm -hmm. Come on. Throw your neck up and try and scare us. There's some interesting rocks here. There's the quartz veins. And the pyrite. And there's even more impressive ones here. Red cyanide. This tanks. is where the gold would be. Okay. In here. Spirit. I wonder if 50 years ago this town had 300 people in it, 300 miners, so it was an old mining town. Now we're at the police station, this is a set of battery stampers behind me. Well, this wheel here had a big belt on it with a big diesel steam machine back here for the smaller wheel. Where do you load your rock? All on the different. Some of them have a big thing here. This one, you just load it in here. Okay. And here it folds out right here. Okay. 
and you got it flows with water. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah there's a little speck there. Oh, yeah. Above gold? Yeah. This is the old police station. Oh, nice built. Stone built. Look at that. The floor, the walls, nice timber frames. Looks like it's been restored. Hello, Sheriff. Is it the jail? Oh, yeah, so it is. That's a jail and the fireplace. Tanga Government Works Essayer Residence, the Manager Residence, the Post Office, the Battery Side So this site was restored in 1984 <laughs> Oh, this is where the workers lived. Houses like that. What's left? Horizontal steam engine. Moving the battery stampers. Is this what this thing was moving? Yep. Well, that must be the. Then had some battery box, this one. That must be all the cyanide reservoirs, tanks, where they were when they were putting all sort of chemicals to separate and purify gold. Do you shine? Does it shine? Is that good one's up? Surface gold was heavier. Look at this one, it's got some sun shines in it. Mm. See, so you got some sparkles around here. You got whoa! Oh, you should bring this one. Uh, uh, nice one. It's all around. That's pyrite. false gold, yeah. Pyrite. Oh, pyrite. Yeah, look at this. You got a bit of this one. Look, there's some gold. Nice shiny quartz crystals in there. Yeah, I can see the triangle. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. You said have the get the water. Go right there. Purifying. Now we're going to a mine called Golden Chance for the quartz outcrops. I agree why they call it Golden Chance, there's a good chance of gold being there. This is there, the old mine shafts. Just walking among those wild flowers. It's spring, end of September, everything is blooming. Foxtails, pussy tails, that's how those plants are called. Huge. 
That's huge. It's like 50 centimeters by 50. Look, this guy, guys, this here's my hand. You probably know the size of that. I mean, this is my head. That's one hand, two hands, that's three hands. Yeah. It's a cocoon. Is it a moth or something? This is the first mine. It's nothing like we've uh, uh, we've been to the New South Wales in Yolo mine. We've got a nice video about that. If uh, you guys are interested, you can go inside and there are all those tunnels through it and and carts still there. We we'll just see what this mine is like. Yellow wall was very very deep and you could just go inside. Check this video. Yeah. Bit of copper. Mum. Oh yeah. Copper. Wow. Oh. So much. Did you see a proper entrance? No, not really. It's possible they crawled under there though. Maybe they just came from the top there. Look, up the top there. Oh, there's quartz right there? Mm, oh yeah, oh yeah, you're right. So I, I imagine they probably mined down here. Look, there's a hole. Yep. <laughs> there is another quartz vein. Look, there's a big one. Yeah, up there and there's some going down. So possibly they mined down here. Oh my god. A lot of it's probably being filled in. It's a very regular shape. Very rectangular. So swing and work in there. Why would they have filled it up? Just the silt, mate. Rainwater, it's been, you know, nearly 150 years. So I get it now, Pop. Look. If I want, I can go into the, you know how? There's a little cave in there. Yeah. If you do a crawl space, you crawl down, I imagine, four or five meters, and you bump into this. See the hole in the gold rain? Look at that. There's a gold vein. A gold vein. Okay, I gave you a 360. Police station where you came from. Maybe you're down there and everything. Copper, quartz, and gold. Beautiful. This is gold. Very deep. Quartz on my hand. Look at I don't know, there's probably, is it a way in? No. No. No cranes. No. Maybe just a shelter. I don't know, maybe they just try to do it and then they just say it will be our shelter. It's another entrance to the mine. What? And so all this side it was active virtually for five to ten years. Is that real? You all have this to is the Joker's down. mine. Huh? Uh huh. Yeah. You have to bend down and go on this channel. Okay. I'll just film the view first in case you'll never see me again. You know where I am. Oh, <gasps> look at those veins. Wow. They're the perfect quartz veins. They found a load of it in here, dug that out. Looks like they found a bit in there, they dug that out. They were probably gonna dig that out, but they won't stop. How deep is that? Well, three meters deep. So it's like this because it's been all. I'm gonna bump my head. Because it, it used to go 
down, oh, right? Yeah, they just pulled it out, or not? Nah. So, so where's the one? only a small dig, this one. Okay. The one didn't produce much. It is a deep one. Oh, I'm scared, I'm scared. I'm scared. I know, imagine if this <gasps> falls below my feet right now. Oh my god, look! I can see my own reflection there. Can you see it? Yeah. Do you think mm. that water is like a hundred meters deep, up? And I had this, is it? How did they even get in and out, Mum? Well, they would have had a big wheel here and a winch set up. And they just went down in a barrel? Yeah. Bought it all out in the barrel. Okay, so this is the Joker's Gorge. What is that called? That's Joker? called. I don't know. And we've been there up the top in the in the mines. And now I think the idea is to go do a bit of fossicking. We're gonna go swimming. So, for a start, we've gotta find which way with the creek we're running. It looks like since everything the sea has washed up against that, the creek runs that way. Gold would be washed up and stuck in here. Start digging okay. the roots. Add the roots. Thank you. 